Norina Flamea, one of the most beautiful rose chevers I've ever seen. I was lucky to get some from my friends from the Thailand Beetle Beetle Club uh, in Bangkok last uh, October. And of course I tried to breed them here. And here was one uh, female. And I want to check now whether we find some larvas uh, in the substrate. Uh, which I mixed with a lot of leaf material. It's a difficult species to breed because it's not uh, known quite a lot how it works but of course I hope that uh, my friends in Thailand they will find out very soon what is the best substrate for egg laying of this very very nice uh, rose cherry. So this will be a hit uh, in the beetle breeder scene if we can easily breed them because they are just stunning beautiful. So let's see here whether we find something. I think we had a sign of some larvas crawling on the bottom of the box and I would be very happy to see that. Oh yeah look! Look how beautiful! We have so many larvas of Torinorina flamea in this subtitle, it's filled. Oh yeah, look, that's really, really nice. So I prepared some bigger boxes for them with a good substrate, wetting it a little more. I mean, the original substrate here is quite dry, but they seem to strive very well. Look, is the one. I will show you one under the microscopic lens here. I mean, now they are probably in the stage of L2, I hope, I think so. So that's the side of them now. And I will give the part of the original material in the box. Look, we have so many. Two foots filled. Torunoria Flamia. That's a real happy moment. If you can see like this. So nice. Imported them from Thailand in October. Now we have beautiful bunch of next generation. So it seems with this lot of leaf material, they seem to like it. And I don't change a lot, I just put back the original material on the top of the box. Also it's part of the fresh pellets. And then I will put I think one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten in the box. So that's I think a good amount for the moment, cover it again and I have a second box so now I have around 20 or more larvas of this very nice species from Thailand. Of course it's a wild caught, uh, originally they were presented at the Bangkok Beetle exhibition. Uh, you can see some videos here also in this channel about this fantastic event of the Thailand People Breeder Club and I asked them whether I can bring some adult of Torunorina Flamea to Europe uh, to try to breed them and I'm very happy to tell you that we have been pretty successful so far. So again, let's see this is the original material. I cover now the new flake soil material that I have prepared for them. And now I count in around 10 more. One, two, three, four, five. Look here. Here is one of the of the adults. It's a stunning, beautiful 
a rose gel. I, you can hardly uh, make a good pictures of this brilliant red green colors. It's really nice. So I have around 10 more larvas here. And now I hope they will develop well in these two boxes and I can tell you later when we find some new adults here. Thanks for watching.